Cody, are you smarter than everybody nope. else? Nope. Are you smarter than your neighbor? <laughs> nope. <laughs> well, it turns out smart people have some interesting habits that put them at the top of the intelligence scale. So on the daily list now this morning, I've got three quirky habits that apparently prove you're smarter than just about everybody. Number one, you talk to yourself. Talking to yourself might be a sign uh -huh. of higher thinking, memory, well, and Cody, perception skills, enough. as you're it turns out. <laughs> In a study from the University of Wisconsin and the University of Pennsylvania, researchers asked uh, people to remember and find objects. They were better able to recall the list of items to look for if they had said the names of the objects out loud to themselves while they were thinking about it. By vocalizing the names of those objects, apparently you're activating visual properties in your brain that help you find them. So if you walk around the house talking to yourself, where are my keys? I know my keys are somewhere. It's yeah, actually a good thing. What's going on? Smart guy. All right. Number two, this was interesting. You swear a lot. Oh, apparently. hell, I am brilliant then. <laughs> Weird. Now, you might think swearing actually is a reflection of <laughs> low education and low intelligence, that when people can't think of the right word, they resort to slang and curse words. But a study found that people who could come up with more curse words had a larger vocabulary <laughs> in general. Verbal ability is one of the traits of people with higher intelligence, uh, apparently, so it shouldn't be surprising that smart people know more curse words, even if they don't use them all the time. Shut yeah. the front I door. like to weave them together like a tapestry. Right, exactly. Mm -hmm. Well, you brainiac, you. <laughs> all right, number three, you might be smarter than everybody else if the sound of chewing annoys you. <laughs> <laughs> A study from Northwestern University found that people who tested high in creative cognition tended to have an inability to filter out irrelevant noise like this. <laughs> that means you're taking it all in, right? Sometimes to a fault, and the sound of people eating or chewing is particularly annoying to you. Interestingly, other studies have shown that chewing gum yourself improves intellectual performance, but not listening to other people chew. It is kind of gross when you think about it. Yeah, it is. All right. More habits of smart people, including cold showers and doodling, are linked to GoodDaySacramento.com. <laughs> Click show info there at the top of the page, and then today's state. Back to you, you stream of curse words. I learned that from Disney. Yeah. Like when you go into the tunnels of Disney, woo, you hear some colorful metaphors, woo. let me tell you, because people have to be happy upstairs the whole time. Well, today,